Hey Fiero fans, welcome back to Winged Horse Garage, a Fiero channel. And before we get started, no matter what happens in 2021, this will be a Fiero channel. But, I'm making an addition to the channel, and I know not everybody will think it's great, but you might just enjoy me tinkering on something other than a Fiero. Although, I promise you, I will do three wait <laughs> I will do three Fiero videos to every one other video on this channel this channel is devoted to the Fiero Pontiac Fiero I fell in love with that car in 1984 and I still love the Fiero So welcome back to the channel and all this will make sense in a minute and through the process of the 2020 it's it seems like I've been infected with car owner virus and people are keep offering me cars and I just can't turn it down I mean they're not all Fieros I mean I have a 2014 Dodge Ram which has been on the channel before I've, I have a 2004 Altima, a 2003 Honda Odyssey, a 1986 SE, a 1988 Pontiac Formula. I have a Honda Elite scooter, but I have a new vehicle that was just added to my fleet. And here it is not a fiero sorry fiero guys don't want to make everybody mad but i couldn't pass up this deal 100 dollars grand marquee i know i know what you're thinking it's a grand marquee okay but uh these cars are very solid built and this one runs fantastic it rides like a dream leather seats heated seats um cassette player and CD player all right but this car has one big problem it's beautiful I mean come on what, what, what could what could be wrong with this car right <laughs> yeah $100 grandma key and it needs a facelift as you can see Ben bumper brackets missing grill miss I have the headlights uh, I just took them off but uh, between me and you you know what I would like to do with this is make a Marauder out of it get the Marauder front end put a fairing on the back can you see it with uh, tinted windows can you see it you take that trim that silver trim and you paint that the same color as the rest of the car that deep burgundy and I see a mercury marauder so call me crazy I promise you this will not be the same car you see today in six months I still bring you plenty of Fiero content I've got the Fiero formula still it's in the garage getting shocks. The SE is in my son-in-law's house. Uh, I just got uh, new wiring for the taillights. So, you know, don't worry. This is still the Fiero channel that you subscribe for. But if you're here to see some Crown Victoria slash Grand Marquis content, welcome to the channel. And y'all have a good, happy, safe New Year's. Hey, focus. Focus, focus, okay, yeah. Here's that big old sweeping dash. 
It's got the CD slash cassette player. Let's see. Oh, let's turn it on. Got a little bit of rattle from the heat shield on the catalytic converter. But other than that, starts up real nice. 180,000. But no knocks. Got your heated seats, leather, a little dirty, but nothing that can't be cleaned up. No rips, no tears in the upholstery, headliner. So, hey, let's see what we got here. Andy Williams. No CD. I mean, it's 2004, but hey is it worth a hundred bucks you tell me what would you do if you were offered a car like this for a hundred dollars would you would you buy it on it i mean i could take it to the junkyard and make a couple hundred dollars in scrap if i wanted to but this car we've got the 4.6 v8 and it's uh well worth a hundred dollars to me Just floats down the road, folks. Look at that old school climate control. I mean, it's got dials, it's got buttons, but it's climate control back in 2004. And this car is just, <laughs> it's a floater, man. Solid as a rock. Well, the previous owner just got uh, the new airbags put in it. So it's, uh, it's a good touring car, I guess you'd say. And here we are. Let's make the locals mad. All right, complete stop. Ready to punch it. Want to hear them tires? Three, two, one. turn it around I'm serious I can see this thing with dual exhaust coming out the back uh, you know this car has a lot of I don't know, potential plan on taking this car to work every day. I work 40 minutes from my house and according to all the Crown Vic guys this should get 20 miles to gallon on the highway. So and that's what my pickup truck gets right now. And my pickup truck's a lot newer and uh, a lot more expensive than this car. So <laughs> I just realized something. I've never had a car with heated seats before. It it's like a, I don't, it's like a mini spa in here with the heated seats. It makes my back feel real good. I don't know. I can get really used to this. Oh yeah. It'd be tough not going to sleep while you're driving with heated seats. So what would you do if someone hands you the keys? of this car and said for a hundred dollars it's yours what would you do would you just haul it down to the junkyard or would you put it back together and use it as a work car what would you do i'm just saying so hey thanks for watching 
this is a Fiero channel. It'll always be a Fiero channel. But if you're new to the channel, you came here to see a Crown Vic or a Grand Marquis. Welcome to the channel. And I hope you enjoy the Fiero content as well as the Grand Marquis content. And as I like to call it, the Marauder. And remember, at Winged Horse Garage, we're keeping the 80s alive, one Fiero at a time. We're here at the junkyard today, and I got my Fiero parts that I needed. But I'm walking around and I'm seeing this. I've never seen a battle wagon like this before. This is a Ford Vanette. And it is a beast. Look at this thing. It's amazing. I mean, look at that. It's like something out of like the Transformers. Incredible. Look at that. Look at all that moss on there. I thought that was paint at first, but that's moss on top of a red van, on top of a white van. Looks like it's got a hitch on the top. Try and sneak in here. Here's the driver's compartment. I don't know if you can see in here or not. But look at this. It's like an apartment in here. A little desk, little sink, little dining area, bed back there. Look. You've got a picture on the wall. Incredible. Lighting. Amazing. Simply amazing. I really wish I could get in there look around give you a little peek inside you know I didn't even get to see cabinets on the wall <laughs> I guess we're in the closet area right now that somebody lived in here who knows how long we think van life is a new thing it's not <laughs> people were doing this in the 40s 50s 60s whatever amazing all right well if you're interested or not but there you go van life fiero style Thank you steps on the side to get up to your I don't know that's not just a luggage rack on there it's amazing <laughs> I wish I had a day to go through this it's so cool 